for the Albino Rhino Beer Review. You have the Rhino, you have the cartoon. Uh, we're just going to do one quick thing uh, while the cartoon picks his beer. Oh! We're going to do this. Um, yeah, there's Simon getting molested by one of my dogs. And the other one was trying to help him. Well, this one feels cool. Oh, 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 there he goes. He's going to get licked in the face by a big black dog. Oh. She got him. She got him. What do you got? Well, it seems like we've got a bit of a theme going today. <laughs> uh, what do we have here? Okay, that's enough. Just relax. Okay. Uh, <laughs> so anyway, you have the rhino and the cartoon, and we're doing a beer by Brewdog. Right this is Elvis Juice. Elvis Juice is a grapefruit-infused IPA at 6.5% oh, yeah. ABV. It's all about juicy IPAs today. <laughs> That's all we're getting. There's so many beers back there too. I uh, maybe I shouldn't be so random. Maybe I should actually choose one. No, no, random's fine. Well. I just can't believe that you've randomly picked all <laughs> IPAs. That's all. Yeah. I'm surprised by that. Me yeah, too. Especially since neither of us use IPAs as our favorite beer. Yeah. That's a really nice color. And I didn't think it was as clear as it was. It's clear, but it's still hazy at it's the same time. It's a little time. bit hazy. And at first I thought it was little super... little off-white head. It's nice. What color is that? That's like... That's almost like an orange. It's very orange. Um, it's orange. Uh, it's orange with a little bit of rust. Okay, well it smells... Definitely smells like fruit. I'm not going to say it's very grapefruit forward on the nose. No, I almost it's get a paper more. mache smell too. Really? What's going on with the malt that you get that? Hmm. But yeah, you're right. It's fruity, but it's, it's you know what? For a uh, for a brew dog beer, this isn't as in your face as I expected it to be. Mm -hmm. Overall, a rounded, pleasant smell. Just not, uh, definitely not what I was expecting. I was expecting a little more of... The it's best before 11.02.18. Okay. I don't know if they're doing that the uh, normal European way of day, month, year, or if they're doing it the international way of month, day, year. Oh. Uh, either way, we're good. Yeah. Because it's 18. Let's try it. Well, let's just yeah, let's get it in this. Ooh, ooh, it's it's like it's like if wine gums made a grapefruit flavor. That's really nice, and it goes away quick. It doesn't linger like a madman. Oh, it's a pretty clean finish. Wow, ooh, it's a but it's it's though. it's white grapefruit. It's pink grapefruit, and it's grapefruit piss. Well, yeah, of course, gotta have that. It's a, and it's a little like it's not it's not full on sour grapefruit. It's it's kind of sweet. It's nice, like a, yeah, yeah it's definitely like a ruby red. This Elvis juice isn't bad. I'll take some Elvis juice. It's good times. I wonder if we're getting that orangey color because they did use the ruby red variety. Maybe that's why. Maybe actually getting some color off of that fruit. Who knows? That is medium bodied, light carbonation. Very easy drinking. It doesn't leave that disgusting mouthfeel that a few beers have tonight. Mm. Small bubbles and a few of them. I'm loving that. Yeah, it's it's almost That's... it's almost cask beer like. It's not, but it's almost. No, no, it's 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 a lightly sparkled <laughs> sort of IPA. It's fucking awesome. This is really fun. Out of ten on that. God. It's hard for me to really rate these because they're not my favorite. I just get super excited when I find one that I like. So I want to give it a massive rating. But I mean, like, I have to be civil about this. This is, this is an 8.5. This is something I'm going to look for. I think it's fantastic. I need to tell people to find it. And it's great. I'll give it an 8 myself. I actually like it as well. I wish there was a little more fruitiness to it. I wish there was a little more rounded on the, on the malt. But it's a great beer. Oh, yeah. Anyway, YouTube. Eight and eight five. Cheers.